Bobby? Oh, I'm gonna go to the tavern. Wait, it's week four? Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna go to the tavern. Bartender drink. Drink. You spend the entire week getting wasted. You gain two charm and one physique. One day, while in the tavern, a heated argument erupts between two patrons. Soon enough, fists are flying and everybody seems to be joining in on the violence. Join the fray, break up the fight. Break up the fight. You're the worst. High charm. You jump on top of a table and yell a plea to the patrons to stop all the violence. Before you know it, everybody has calmed down, chatting to one another like nothing ever happened. Thanks for that, says the bartender, while slipping you a small sack of coins. Gain nice. one wealth. I made friends here. I'm going back to the Alchemy Tower to brew more potions. Shocker. Hey man, we had a party last time, and I was the hit. <laughs> you spend the week experimenting with different potion brews. You gain two magic and one mind. One day, while in the tower, one of the alchemists asks you to watch his potion while he's out. Soon after he leaves, the potion begins bubbling out of control. If you don't do something soon, it'll explode. Well, you're a magical genius, so that doesn't Are happen. you going to throw it or drink it? Drink it. I'm going to drink it. You quickly drink the potion. Your stomach can't seem to handle the potion. Fire erupts up your esophagus for a solid minute. You're shooting a jet of fire from between your lips. That burns. You lose two physique. What a learning experience, <laughs> though. You gain one mind. Learning. Wow. Kelsey. Oh, um... I'll go to the slums. Fight crime? Or pickpocket or fight crime? I'm gonna fight crime. You spend the week not handle his potions. <laughs> <laughs> you spend the week outsmarting and beating up criminals. Potion seller. Potion seller. You gain one mind, one physique, and one finesse. One night you hear cheering coming from an alleyway. Peering in, you see a crowd of men cheering on dogs, violently ripping each other apart. This is your apart. chance, Jake. One of the men spots Wait, you and asks, healthy? Oi, would you like to participate in our little betting game? Mm. I'm going to stop the dogs. She's going to stop the dog fights. I'm going to try. drink explosions. <laughs> <laughs> the charm's not good. You try to convince the gamblers that dogfighting is wrong. Your words fall on deaf ears. Very quickly, they all get quite angry with it's you. Beat ass. One of them walks up to you, pulls out a knife. You punch him right in the face before he's even able to react. He collapses on the ground, clutching his bloody nose. The rest of the gamblers pack up their things and run away. You stop the town's illegal dogfighting. You feel very good about yourself right now. You gain one physique, one finesse, one mind, one charm, one magic. I've successfully mm -hmm. saved every dog. Woo! Alright, Ryan. Yog's got nothing. Oh, man. Me. Well, I'll go to the palace. Mm -hmm. Go to the ball. Administration or ball? Ball. Ball, okay. You spend the week attending fancy gatherings. Gain two charm and one finesse. One day, you accidentally bump into a duke. Mm -hmm. Ooh! Watch where, you go Watch where you're going, filthy peasant. Oh. Shoves you out of the way with his hand and continues Punch walking. Him. Passive aggressive response, Sorry. active aggressive <laughs> response. Active aggressive response. Fuck you, dude! You shove him back. He stumbles slightly. That was kind of lame. Yeah, you you lose really one car. Well. That's it. <laughs> when it arrives it this like, time, mm -hmm. how will we fare? Will we once more rebuild? Move on? Be strong? Have we forgotten? I found Bobby's ghost pictures. Bobby? Well, eat one. Do not eat, not eat one, Cal. No, that's spicy. If we get a dono, you can try one, but be aware, it will be an issue for you. It's insane. It's like, yeah. I was Um, I like they going don't smell spicy. to the slums. Do you fight crime or pickpocket? Oh, sorry. Fight crime. You want to be the crime or fight I the crime? I want to fight the crime. Spend a week outsmarting and beating up criminals. You gain one mind, one physique, and one finesse. One day, while wandering the slums, you notice that the, s the stones used to line the road seem to have a certain pattern to them. You don't manage to figure out the mystery, but you still feel pretty smart for noticing the pattern on the tiles. Gain one mind. You know where I'm going. Ruin more options. You spend a week experimenting right? with different potion brews. Gain two magic in one mind. One day you hear cries for help coming from the next room. Running over to investigate, you see that the alchemists there have accidentally created an ooze monster. What That's... else is new? How do you dispatch the ooze? Punch I it! Blast the ooze <laughs> with some magic. Punch you it. Eat it! That's what I've been working on! Punch it! You pulverize the ooze into a puddle with an array of magic spells. The alchemists all cheer. You gain one charm. I'm good. I want to go to the palace today. The alchemists all want to go. 
attend the ball or do administration work? I'm gonna attend the ball. Yeah. You spend the week attending fancy gatherings, gain two charm and one finesse. One day, you decide to lean up against a wall just to take a break. It rotates as you apply pressure and you stumble down a set of stairs. Oh, shit. You enter a large dusty room filled with barrels. You found the king's famous wine cellar. Oh, shit. Host a secret party in here. Keep quiet about what you saw. I don't think I can get away with a party in here. My charm is... Do the Not party. Right. Send it. Do Send the party. It. I'll, I'll do the party. Yeah! <laughs> Welcome to the Cosmic Crusaders, where we peer pressure people into making decisions we want. <laughs> All your friends show up and the drinking begins. It gets lit. Fast. All this drinking improves your fortitude. You gain two physique. All this socializing improves your social skills. You gain two charm. What? It went really well for you. Woo! Party! Brian. Uh, I would like to go to the hospital. Clean up, tend to patients. Oh, I'm not very smart, am I? <laughs> I'll uh, hydrate when oh. Your mind is seven, but your lowest stat is physique if we're not counting wealth. I'll clean up then. Uh, you spend a week stealing your mind against the horrors of the hospital, making sure it's as clean as can be. Gain one mind, one physique, and earn one wealth. <laughs> one day, a patient comes into the hospital with sores that nobody's ever seen before. While waiting by his bedside, he looks to you and rudely asks for a glass of water. Get him water or ignore him? The I'll man's got sores all over yeah, his body. Yeah, get him water. <laughs> you bring him a small glass to quench his thirst. He takes a large sip, swigs it around, then proceeds to spit it at you. You manage to quickly duck underneath the stream of water. You oh. scold the obviously insane man for spitting at you. The scolding is good practice for social interaction. You gain one charm. Oh, good deal. There you How are. fucking dare you, sir? It's like... almost here. Almost. Almost. Bobby? Um, I'm gonna go to... Oh, Maple Maven redeemed hydrate. Yeah, I, I already did that. I'm gonna go to... Is there anybody? Mm. Is I'm gonna go to the forest. Okay. Chop wood or hunt? Hunt. You spend the week hunting defenseless critters. You gain two finesse and sell the pelts for one wealth. One day you come across a group of people in the woods. From the expressions on their faces, they appear to be lost. Rob them or help them? Rob them, Bobby. No, help them. Rob them, Bobby. Help them. Well, I think the obvious choice is, you know, what's my what's my charm? Twelve. What's my finesse? Eleven. Well, I'm gonna help them. You confront the group and try to help them find their way back to town. Be a good person. With these, you lead everyone back to town. Extremely grateful, the group gives you a small token of their appreciation. You gain two wealth. Bobby is the richest of all of us. I'm going to spend my last week, um, I think, at the Alchemy Tower brewing potions. Jake, are you going to brew potion? You spend the week experimenting with different potion brooms. You gain two magic and one mind. Nothing out of the ordinary happens to you this week. Ouch. <laughs> um, I'm going to go... To, I'm gonna spend my last week at the arena. Ooh! Back where you started. Computer bet. Competing. You spend a week fighting brutes in the arena. You gain two physique and one finesse. One day, in between matches, you stumble upon one of the higher ranked fighters ingesting <gasps> illegal strength potions. He's just. Oh. Please, miss, don't report me, she cries. Uh, I'll even share some of my potion with you if you keep quiet, right. she adds. Take her off or report her. I'm, I'm gonna report her. Well, you're not going to take the potion? No, I'm not going to take the potion. She's not you from the last game. That's how I become fucking the dead inside. You report the fighter to the arena officials. They thank you for bringing it to their attention and hand you a small sack of coins. Gain two wealth. The fighter is investigated and receives a lifetime ban from the arena. Wow. That's one step closer to number one. Brian. <laughs> I love it. Brian. Uh, I'll go to the palace. Ball or administration? Ball. Someone's got to do this administration work. I'll do it if we play another one. <laughs> you spend the week attending fancy gatherings. You gain two charm and one finesse. One day, the court jester approaches you. Would you like to learn to juggle? Like he to asks to juggle. excitedly. I'll teach you everything I know for a small sum. Sure, one wealth or no thanks. You didn't even get to fuck when you didn't know how to juggle. <laughs> I mean, I guess learning to juggle is 
not a problem. So sure? So sure, yeah. You spend the day with the Jester practicing your juggling technique. You improve dramatically, gain two finesse and another two finesse. Oh shit, that's you, right. You happily pay the Jester for his services, you lose one wealth. The storm arrives in the night. By the morning, it still rages. For three full days, the tempest puts us through a grinder, mm -hmm. drowns us, crushes us, ruins us. But then it ends. We see the graveyard. Our home has become our home. Does anything yet live? Is it? Are we past saving? Are we? Bobby, what are you going to do? What's my, uh, what's my charm? Your charm is 12. What's my wealth? Seven. What's my finesse? 11. Leader. Fair. You take it upon yourself to be the leader of the survivors. You expertly delegate and prioritize tasks. You give motivating speeches and act as an effective mediator in disputes. This helps rebuilding. This helps the rebuilding effort significantly. Uh, Jake, I know what you're gonna be. I'm gonna be the conjurer. But Jake, is your magic high enough? <laughs> you take it upon yourself to conjure up supplies for the town. With your magic, you summon supplies of the highest caliber. With little effort, you're summoning high quality lumber and food from out of nowhere. This helps the rebuilding effort significantly. Kelsey? I'm gonna be the builder. You take it upon yourself to help rebuild the town by hand. You you rebuild homes at breakneck speed, impressing the rest of the survivors. This helps the rebuilding effort significantly. All right, Ryan. Ryan. Uh, I'm gonna be the tailor. Is the town drunk? We're all pretty good at town, <laughs> uh, town drunk. <laughs> you volunteer to weave and mend clothing for the survivors to keep warm. You make and mend clothing faster than anyone would have expected. Every survivor now has an excess number of scarves, <laughs> socks, and hats to keep warm. This Good helps shit. to rebuild Damn. the survival effort immensely. Do you think we win? And I so, hope. we set about our tasks once more living our lives, this time in a way we might never have expected, or even wanted. But in the end... Will you? We flourished! <laughs> Towers yes! wrecked and ravaged rose towards the sky. Trees took root, then blossomed. We all blossomed. And though it took a long while, and though it took a lot from us, our future is bright. Should the Yog ever return, we will be ready. Led by Bobby! Woo! Bobby, you're ending. Hello? Okay. I'm impatient, sorry. With the town rebuilt, you don your costume once more, eager to fight crime. As Bobby does. In an odd twist of events, the Yogg appears to have brought everyone closer together. You can't seem to find even a trace of criminal activity in the town. We killed all the criminals! I killed all the crime! You travel to new lands in search of crime that must be punished. You either live long enough to die a hero, or you see yourself become the villain. With the town fully rebuilt, you spend more and more time in the Alchemy Tower. I don't know how you could spend more time in there. <laughs> Your potion brewing abilities quickly become among the best in the world. Your health and mana potions are considered world-class delicacies with people venturing far and wide to buy them. I like that they say the word man. But you never learn how to brew a love potion. Oh! 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 No! With the town rebuilt, you decide to become a full-time arena warrior. Oh, fuck yeah. You slowly rise the rank, knocking out scores of fighters. Even ones as great as Jean the Beautiful. Guys, her name's Kelsey Jean. Before long, you become the arena champion. Woo! I kept ratting them out for juicing. <laughs> you narked and you became the champion! That's how we do! Woo! Best of the best. Tales are sung far and wide of your mighty feats of strength. But the love was inside you the whole time. With the town rebuilt, Ryan, you decide to celebrate. You organize a huge festival in honor of the bravery that helps so save so many lives. The first one is so successful, you decide to make it an annual tradition. Every year, the festival gets bigger and more elaborate, and every year it costs more and more money to put on. You have to start charging admission, and no one is happy about it. The annual festival slowly fades out of relevance, and the log <laughs> is cancelled completely. You don't really know what to do with your life after all of that. Hey everyone, you did great. You really flourished in this post yog time. Except Ryan fucks it. Ryan's not allowed to have a happy ending <laughs> in this game. <laughs> That's so funny. Why? Why? <laughs> Ryan becomes a failed festival player. <laughs> 
Hey, you know what? <laughs> That's so funny. Go on. Do yeah, wanna, you uh, didn't slaughter an entire forest of people. <laughs> no script. I would rather that than what I did. <laughs> 